When we think of deserts, we often picture vast, barren landscapes covered in golden sand, where plants struggle to survive. This extreme environment naturally makes people associate it with harsh living conditions. However, something remarkable has happened in the Dalit Banner Desert in Inner Mongolia, China. In an astonishing effort, locals managed to raise 1.2 million rabbits in the desert. Not only did this help reverse the desertification process, but it also significantly improved the livelihoods of local communities. In just a few years, this once lifeless sandy terrain transformed into a thriving green oasis. But what kind of rabbits were capable of bringing about such an incredible change in such a short time? And what's the fascinating story behind this transformation? If you enjoy our content, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel so you never miss out on our latest videos. Now let's dive into today's topic. China was once one of the most severely affected countries in the world when it came to desertification. For decades, the country has been grappling with worsening land degradation. According to global desertification data from the 1990s, China's desertified land area reached a staggering 1.714 million square kilometers, nearly one-fifth of the nation's total land area. Unfortunately, this number has continued to rise over time. By the early 21st century, China's desertification problem was advancing at an alarming rate of 10,400 square kilometers per year. As of 2015, the total desertified land area had expanded to 2.62 million square kilometers, covering about one-third of the country's land. Faced with this crisis, China refused to stand by and do nothing. The country understood that taking active measures to combat desertification was not only a national priority, but also a crucial step in preserving the global ecological balance. In response, China launched a series of initiatives and projects aimed at preventing and reversing desertification. So what specific measures has China taken to reclaim its land from the desert? Starting in 1988, renowned Chinese scientist Qian Shuixin made significant critiques of desert greening strategies. He argued that while afforestation, wind barriers, and sand fixation are crucial, they alone are not sufficient to fully resolve desertification. To effectively combat this issue, he suggested approaching it from an industrial development perspective, integrating grasslands, farmland, and animal husbandry for a more sustainable solution. This concept quickly captured the attention of many Chinese entrepreneurs. Recognizing the commercial potential of desert land, they decided to put theory into action. Investors flocked to these once-neglected areas, committing up to 750 million yuan to establish a 300,000-acre salix plantation in the desert aiming to eventually green 3 million acres of surrounding land. To further enhance the synergy between desert control and economic growth, Chinese entrepreneurs began searching for animal species that could support both efforts. After extensive research, China introduced a rabbit species from France, initially met with skepticism. Many doubted whether rabbits could play any role in desertification control. However, once these rabbits arrived, they produced remarkable results. Their natural behaviors and rapid reproduction rate not only contributed significantly to desert greening, but also generated considerable economic benefits for local communities. So how exactly does this rabbit help manage desertification? Known as the Rex Hare, these rabbits, originally from France, are large, short-haired breeds now thriving in China's deserts. They require dry and clean environments, making arid deserts an ideal habitat. In these conditions, rex hares display distinct ecological behaviors. They instinctively dig into the ground to search for grass roots and hay, but avoid hard-shelled seeds, as their digestive systems cannot process them. Efforts to combat desertification require innovative and sustainable solutions. One such approach is the use of rex hares, a species that is proving to be a game-changer in transforming barren desert landscapes into thriving ecosystems. These rabbits contribute significantly to soil improvement, vegetation growth, and even economic development, making them an invaluable asset in China's desert management strategies. The excavation activities of rex hares provide multiple benefits for desert soil. As these rabbits dig burrows and move around, they help aerate the soil, loosening compacted sand and allowing moisture to penetrate deeper. This process significantly enhances soil fertility, making it more suitable for plant growth. The improved aeration not only prevents soil degradation, but also facilitates the absorption of essential nutrients, creating an environment where vegetation can thrive. 
One of the most remarkable contributions of Rex hairs is their ability to enhance desert vegetation. Their droppings act as natural fertilizers, enriching the soil with essential nutrients that promote plant growth. Additionally, the seeds that pass through their digestive system remain intact, leading to natural seed dispersal that further aids in reforestation efforts. Thanks to these combined effects, desert plants now experience an astonishing survival rate of 96% or higher. This success has positioned the rex hare as a critical species in China's ambitious ecological restoration projects. The vast desert areas that were once considered inhospitable are now undergoing a transformation, largely due to the positive impact of these animals. Chinese scientists have recognized this potential and have taken steps to integrate rex hares into large-scale desert rehabilitation programs. An extraordinary feature of the rex hare is its impressive reproductive capability. Unlike many conventional animals, which have slow breeding cycles, the rex hare reproduces at a rate 25 times faster than typical mammals. A single female can give birth to approximately 40 offspring annually, ensuring a rapidly growing population. China has already successfully bred over 1.2 million rex hares in desert areas, reinforcing the sustainability of this project. With such a high reproduction rate, the rabbits can quickly spread across the landscape, further accelerating desert greening. More importantly, their role extends beyond ecological benefits, they also offer significant economic advantages. In addition to their environmental contributions, rex hares have also become an important resource in China's agricultural and commercial sectors. Their meat is considered a delicacy, providing a reliable food source that is both nutritious and sustainable. As the breeding population grows, so does the availability of high-quality meat, supporting local communities and food production efforts. Furthermore, the soft and dense fur of the rex hair is highly prized in the textile industry. The demand for premium fur materials has led to the development of a thriving market for luxury clothing, including fur coats and other high-end fashion products. This dual-purpose approach, using the rabbits for both ecological restoration and commercial gains, demonstrates the immense potential of integrating wildlife into sustainable economic models. A key component of this ecological transformation is the integration of Salix, a resilient plant species that thrives in desert environments. Salix plays a crucial role in desert stabilization, as its extensive root system prevents soil erosion, reduces the impact of strong winds, and retains moisture. But beyond its role in land preservation, salix also serves as an essential food source for rex hares. The nutrient-rich leaves and branches of this plant provide the rabbits with sustenance, allowing them to thrive without relying on external feed sources. This natural cycle, where salix supports the rex hares and the rabbits in turn enhance soil fertility, has created a self-sustaining ecosystem that benefits both plant and animal life. By integrating forestry, grassland, and desert agriculture, China has successfully established an interconnected industrial system where nature and human intervention work in harmony. This innovative strategy not only combats desertification, but also promotes economic growth, demonstrating how environmental restoration and financial prosperity can coexist. As Rex hair breeding programs continue to expand, the positive effects on desert ecosystems are becoming more evident. Vast stretches of previously barren land are now covered in lush vegetation, forming multiple oases that enhance biodiversity and climate stability. This transformation has led to a significant improvement in the desert's natural landscape, making it a more hospitable environment for both wildlife and human settlements. The success of these initiatives has not gone unnoticed. The United Nations Environment Program has officially recognized China's desert restoration efforts as a global desert ecological economic demonstration zone, highlighting the effectiveness of this approach on an international scale. By 2021, forest land and grassland in desert regions had expanded dramatically. Just a few decades ago, vegetation coverage in these areas was below 3%, making large parts of the land uninhabitable. However, due to persistent efforts in desert greening, the vegetation coverage rate has skyrocketed to an impressive 84.7%. What was once an unforgiving wasteland has now been transformed into a thriving oasis, setting an example for other nations struggling with desertification. China's success in integrating rex hares into its desert restoration projects showcases the power of innovative and nature-based solutions. By leveraging the natural behaviors of these rabbits, scientists have found a way to restore ecological balance, while also driving economic growth. 
the combination of soil improvement, increased vegetation, and a self-sustaining food cycle has proven that deserts can be revitalized with the right strategies. As more countries explore sustainable solutions for land restoration, China's model stands as an inspiring testament to what can be achieved when science, agriculture, and environmental conservation work hand in hand. If these efforts continue at the same pace, the world may soon witness even more remarkable transformations where once barren landscapes are reborn as flourishing ecosystems. The story of the Rex Hare and its role in desert restoration is just the beginning of what could become a global movement toward a greener and more sustainable future. Rex Hare breeding has grown into a major industry for local communities, with farmers earning an average annual income of around 20,000 U.S. dollars. By 2025, it is projected that the number of rabbits raised in China's desert regions will surpass 1.8 million. Moreover, the diverse industrial chain built around Rex Hare breeding, spanning ecological farming and tourism, plays a crucial role in supporting the local economy. In this new era, China has fully integrated big data and drone technology into its desertification control efforts, leading to the establishment of the Belt and Road Desert Green Economic Innovation Center. These advancements have significantly improved desert landscapes, turning the region into a model for desert management in China. China's ongoing commitment to afforestation is not just about restoring the ecosystem. It reflects a deep understanding of the opportunities within the green economy. By merging environmental sustainability with economic growth, this strategy has delivered real financial gains for Chinese citizens while earning global recognition and praise.